Live Bahrain one. Hello, welcome to White Eagles TV. This is a post-match uh, review of the game. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get to see the game uh, this morning. I just couldn't get a good enough stream. The one I did find just kept cutting out in and out. It would play for a couple of seconds and stop for a, longer than that. And after a while, I just gave up. So I just watched Twitter. I watched you know everyone talking about the game, Serbia footy. I watched the uh, line, live scores and just saw that, you know, we, we pumped them pretty much. Uh, and it looks like a good performance by the boys. Uh, so let's let's watch some of the highlights. I found it on YouTube. And this is our first goal, Dushan Tadic's. I'll just move this across a little bit so you can see him. Uh, let's have a look. Okay, let's watch it. Dushan Tadic from a free kick. Oh, what a free kick. Look at that. That's on. That's beautiful. Pigeon in the corner. There's another reaction lap. Keep on the right side as well. I'm not sure what this commentator is saying, but he seems pretty excited about this goal. Now, this is their goal. Um, I didn't think this was a pen. It sort of just cut in on Pavlovic and got brought down very easy. He went down looking for it. Yeah, that's for me, that's not a penalty, but it was given. Yeah, sure, it may have stepped across him, but... I don't think this is a pen, and he stepped up, and Milinkovic Savic uh, went the wrong way. You know, and uh, he's just gonna have a great, great chance. This is the first half, that was a Jovic. Maybe, a, maybe, a, yeah, it was offside. Would not count it, but he's gonna have a good chance by our boys. Went across the goal. Who's that? Illich. Yep, number 24, Illich. As you can see, I'm wearing the jersey that the boys are wearing right now in this game. He's not a great shot. I got taken down. Like I said, I'm not sure what this gentleman's saying, but he seems pretty excited. And still the first half. Oh, that's a great, great cross in there. You know, set piece is definitely something Serbia's got to utilize. We're the tallest team at this World Cup, so we've got to utilize our, our, you know, mid, our, um, the corners and free kicks. That that could be a hidden, hidden gem for us. You know, Tadic is a great free kick taker. Oh, how that does it in. And let's have a look. And that's Tadic's second goal. There's no commentary in them. They must have. He probably just ran out of steam, the commentator. He's just so pumped. Yeah, here we go. Third goal. Lovely ball in back pass to Vlahovic. Great finish as well at the end. And I believe this is our last goal. This should be a Luka Jovic goal. No, uh, Djuricic goal. Uh, uh, that's our fourth. And this is our last goal. Look, look, look which it's, it's fantastic that he got, you know, a goal just before the World Cup. Just a bit of confidence, you know, for a striker just to get that one goal. We'll do, we'll do wonders. We'll do wonders for him. And that's, you yeah, know, that's great. That's what he needed. And obviously, there's a bit of post-match uh, reaction here. And how good is this uh, football service, Serbia, uh, social media, like on Twitter, on Instagram, YouTube? Fantastic. It's really giving us a close insight to the um, to the team. Here's Mitro meeting some of the local local fans, signing some autographs. Uh, Mitro didn't play. Obviously, his ankle is still causing him problems. We don't know. Maybe it is, and maybe it is. Maybe it's uh, just a ploy by Stojkovic, so no one knows that he's fit and ready to play. But look at him. He seems pretty, pretty happy. He was in good spirits. And there the boy is over here. You know, and who? You know, local fans chanting Serbia, Serbia. Incredible. Hello, Dushan Tadic gives his jersey out to someone. Oh, and that's a pick of good sort. That's a pick of good sort. Lucho, two goals, assistencia. Not bad for the Uvertiru, the Svetsko Prvenstvo. 
Dobro, stvarno nije bitno ovaj, ko daje, ko namešta golove, najbitnije da se u utakmicu niko nije povredio, to je najbitnije. Za... And, and he's, he's on money there, no one got injured, who cares who scored the goals, who cares the ESS, as long as you win the game, right? So, That's fantastic. Mislim da, eto, svetsko prvenstvo je najbitnije, tako da najbitnije da se niko nije povredio, da smo pobedili i idemo dalje. I pored teškog vremena, dobro ste ovo izgurali, dobro ste istrčali. Pa jeste, bilo je malo na početku teško. And he's right, the, the pitch conditions were terrible, probably humid. Uh, first game the boys played together since the Norway victory. That's fair enough, friendly or not. You, you want to win the game. You, you're out there, you, you, you've assembled. I just want to cut to the end where Mitro talks. Let's see what Mitro has to say. I'd love to know where you can buy this shirt from. And here it is. This is the question. Are you ready? The, the guy's asking. Let's see what he has to say. Okay. Okay, well he says he's ready, he said he wouldn't be there if he wasn't ready, so he, he seems pretty happy, he seems pretty pumped, so... Yeah, he says he feels fine physically. Yeah. Oh, there you go. He said he's, he's fit. He's running well. So I guess he's ready for the World Cup. It just must be. And there you go, he says the atmosphere in the camp has never been better. Uh, and fingers crossed, he's ready for that game against Brazil. Vlahovic in tandem up front. What, you know, Tadic fleet feeding the balls. Um, this looks good. And, you know, it's a fantastic win, 5 1. As we've gone through the through the um, the highlights, some of the goals that were set up were fantastic, and you know I believe I believe we're ready, uh, and so this time next week we would have been played our first game against Brazil, and hopefully I'll do a video where we win, and the uh, and everyone's pumped. I know I'm going to put money on that game, that's for sure. Serbia to win, absolutely. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, tune in probably on, I might make another video on Monday. Just about how the team's going before the uh, big game on Friday. Uh, thanks for tuning in.